Wow, this guy moves pretty far. You gotta be careful of him. All right, you gonna, you want some more? Oh, you want some more? I'm gonna go ahead and send a ghetto on this one. Oh, you want some more? They want some mo. They want some mo. They want some mo. Bring it. I might even send Chris's crew after after Uber. The only problem with that is they're a little slow because of Leo, and Chris is not the fastest. She's strong, and she is tank worthy. She's not the fastest though. But we're doing pretty good. We already got rid of Sazerai's crew and a whole group, two groups of soldiers. We're about to get rid of a third group of soldiers right now. We are on a rolly roll, do lo no no no. And this shit is over, son. But we are gonna have to retreat, or at least take a step back and heal for after this one. Because Boris, oh shit, don't kill my Boris Karloffis. How dare you? How dare you? Boris Karloffis does not play. Oh my god, stop hitting him! Stop it! Piece of shit. Hit my Boris. Fuck your shit up, son. Okay. All that's left is the main units now. We got rid of everybody. All their little fucking grunts went down quick like little bitches. Alright, we gotta move Ghetto back. He needs to heal badly. You know the best part about what we did is we didn't even get <laughs> let Sazerai do his magic. He just came in to try and fight me and he went down real quick. Um, I'm actually gonna put Hugo here. To be like mop up backup because I, I I'm scared of Uber's unit still no matter who he faces I'm still scared this won't be easy fight with everything you've got if we stall long enough there'll be hope we don't need to stall we're about to win we're about to win these motherfuckers ain't shit oh Uber's scared Uber is scared all right fucking Albert wants some tell him to come get some Chris has got this crew yeah none of these guys are even in their their groups they're just kind of lingering while they're they send their soldiers to do their dirty work bunch of lame sauce bitches is what they are hey 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 lay off my girls yeah hit the dudes lay off my girls why is Roland so weak sauce I don't like Roland that much I need to level his ass up or get him out of my army useless bad Queen is beast Chris is obviously beast she just took out one dude in on her own turn by herself and then Leo is just beast mode. He does not even get hurt. He's he's too beast. Anyway, we're going to take this little crew out like ain't none. Albert's crew ain't shit. All that's going to be left on the field is Uber, and we're going to go fuck him up real good. Oh, real nice. Man, she didn't even take that much damage. I'll take I'll send her again if the motherfucking motherfucking douche cakes want a fucking piece. You want a piece too, Dios? I'm going to send my fucking I'll send Chris after you again. I'm a little worried about Roland. He's the only one that took a lot of damage, though. Everybody else is good. We'll send Roland again. We'll send Chris again, rather. And then, uh, if it's looking bad after one turn, maybe we'll run. I don't know. We'll see. We'll see, we'll see how it looks after one, one, one turn of the clock of the battle. But see, I do so much damage, and as long as they, they, my team can shake and bake a little bit, we'll be okay. Like, Queen totally would have died had she not shook that first dude. We need to get Leo and Chris up in there to take the brunt of this damage, though. There you go. Get up in there, girls. Oh, no. Don't, no, don't die, queen. Don't die. Don't you dare die. Fucking Chris. It's not the time to be missing, bro. Be easy. Okay. Maybe we should run. Uh, I'm scared to run, though. Go for it. Oh, he ran. Nice. I did not expect him to run. Dios is a bitch tits. Ha, 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 ha. Okay, that was uh, that worked out in my favor. Sweet. Nobody in my unit died. Beautiful, beautiful. All right, I'm actually going to send Chris. <sighs> Ghetto did not get a heal as much as I was hoping. All right, you know what I'm going to do? I'm going to move Chris back. I'm trying to save every unit. I don't want any units to die. Um, I'm actually going to go ahead and... Ooh, I really want to go for the attack here. I would love to take this motherfucker out right now. I'm going to do it. Go, go, Hugh, go, go, Hugh, go, go. You got this. One guy's almost dead, and the other two are going to be super fucked. So the first guy, oh, I thought he was going to die on the first turn. That would have been awesome. Night Night to the Dios. Bio con Dios. My favorite. Pon ton 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 I had nothing. I had nothing. There was no joke behind that one. Nothing. I was trying to be cool with my Spanish. It didn't work. It did not work out so well for me. These guys, super fucked. Oh man, Hugo is beast mode -ish. All right, 
done. These guys didn't even get to attack me, then they're already all dead. Hugo's crew is really good. The fact that we fought Uber that one time and he beat me was actually amazing. Anyway, Dios got wrecked. All right, we're good. We're good. I'm just gonna leave my crew exactly as is. Uber, their perseverance is remarkable. Indeed, they are much tougher than before. Indeed, they are because all that's left is your fucking demon. All you got left is a demon, and your demon ain't shit, son. I'm actually. Ooh, wait, what? More forces. We can't possibly. Wait, what do you mean more forces? Lax, they're ours. Oh shit. It's moi. The Camaro Alliance of the Free Knights stands beside Grassland. We fight for the Firebringer. Choose your targets. Wah! We've been protected to you, Flame Champion! Wah! And uh, us too! Thomas, what are you doing here? Come on, Thomas! I knew I should have made an appropriate yell for him. Okay. <clears throat> we come from Orange to answer the Flame Champion's call to arms. We fight as one. <laughs> Green Wall's been so many, but from where? They come to serve under the Flame Champion. More forces from the south. Enough for now. Withdraw in an orderly fashion and send a message to Crystal Valley. Caesar, you're here? Is this your doing? Afraid so, Albert. If you're gonna help Harmonia, then I will help you stand. I will help Grassland stand against you. My plan is finally complete. So apparently Caesar and Albert know each other. Still being sweet to weaklings, I see. What will be gained by this? You'd understand if you had the blood of Leon, our grandfather. Wait, what? Our grandfather? You mean we have two Silverbergs? History is shaped by the individual, don't you think so, little brother? Wait, little brother? What? Silence! I have no more relation to you. I will not let the world sink into the chaos you desire. It's your life to throw away. So, what? They're running away! We won! We really won! Why is Lewis even talking? It's true! It's damn true! Oh shit! Huh. It looked like the enemy was here. He must have wandered off. Now, my lady, please stop. Must you insult, insist on insulting the Flame Champion? I will not be made a fool of! How dare the Flame Champion appear after we return to Tinto! I will speak with him, or else! But, my lady, there's no excuse to call on Tinto Army. What? Did you say something? No, my lady. <laughs> well, then, Lily shows up all of a sudden, kind of out of nowhere and late as usual. Halek and Moi showed up with a bunch of reinforcements, including Thomas. That was pretty cool. We didn't really need them to win, though. I would have took Uber out on my own. Yeah, if you beat Uber before that happens, you'll win anyways. But if you last to that point, you get reinforcements and then they run away like little bitches. Anyways, huzzah, huzzah, victorious, huzzah, huzzah, victorious, <laughs> look at all these guys, <laughs> oh, here comes our flame champion, oh yeah, guess who, flame champion coming through, baby, rolling deep too, man, rolling deep, son, you were the key to our victory, we wouldn't have one without you. Hugo, our hero, we're all very proud of you. We'll be proud to fight alongside you. You sure are popular around here. Indeed I am. It was a close victory, so they are very happy. Whoa, we shall have blood in war for the flame champion! <laughs> indeed. Qui indeed, sir. Qui indeed. Shut it! Just shut it! My helmet doesn't... Work as earmuffs. Nobody likes the war cry. At least not the ducks. Ducks don't like the war cry. Anyway, Lily, what the f are you doing here all of a sudden? Just showing up out of nowhere and shit. Kid, got yourself killed, girl. Is that you, Hugo? It's been a long time. You know, you had some nerve to leave without me. Bitch, please, you were the one that was gone. Oh, uh, I'm sorry, Lily. You must be joking, miss. Weren't you going back to Tinto because the caravan hadn't arrived? Be quiet. By the way, I heard the Flame Champion is around. Where is he? Tell me. You're looking at him, baby. 
What? Uh, ding. <laughs> Loving it. Loving it. Just show her your hand, baby. Just show her your hand. Really? You're the flame champion? Why didn't you tell me? Well, you see, I wasn't the flame champion before, but now I am the flame champion. So, I didn't tell you because I wasn't. I see. Now I get it. Oh, that took a while. <laughs> All right, count me in. I don't want to see the grasslands taken over by Harmonia. Miss Lily. I will join the Firebringer tomorrow. I don't mind being co-leader, Hugo. Wait, what? Co-leader? Uh... Hmm... Did I promote you to that? Phew, tough luck, buddy. Tough luck, what? He wanted to go back home and fuck his wife. <laughs> Ain't happening anytime soon. Anyway, officially, Lily has now joined the 108 stars along with her escort service, Reed and Samus. So that's three more stars of destiny in the book. Along with pretty much the rest of our army, which is pretty cool. Um, I don't think we'll actually officially get a list of all the people that just joined. We'll have to look at it later. They didn't really join officially yet. You'll see. I, I don't know why I'm even talking about it yet. But I think what we need to do now is we need to go back to the knights parlor in the upstairs area. Oh, this is not gonna. This is not. Mm, this is not the right way. No, I don't want to talk to you, sir. This is not. Mm, this is not the right way. This is. This, well, I mean, we can go this way. Just that 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 door is not the way. Up here's the way. Let's go the right way. The right way. The right way. I hope this is where we need to go. If this isn't where we need to go, I'm not entirely sure where we need to go then. Yes, okay, we're, we, made, we made the right choice. Here we go. More cutscene. The best. Everybody's in here celebrating victory. Aw, snap. Even Lily. Return of our hero, I suppose. Dupa. I'm not being skeptical. I know we must cooperate follow and follow the leadership of the new successor. Damn right, Dupa. You fall in line. A flame champion will fucking hear it. Then you agree to the ceasefire and to combine forces until the situation is settled. Yes, the Karai clan will join as Firebringer. We'll forget our prior animosities for now. Same with the Lizard clan. We must do everything in our power to survive. We of the Duck clan were the first to rise to the call of the flame champion. We will be there again. As a representative of the Kamaro Free Knights, I declare our willingness to join as Firebringer. We too will join to prepare our past debts for the gratitude we owe. I read that completely backwards. <laughs> Good enough. Knew you'll help as well. Thomas, you're, um... Uh, yeah, okay. Who, who are you looking at? Oh, Lily? Uh, are you in? You know what I'm about to say. There's no way we'll stand by and watch Harmonia take over. Tinto is in, huh? Hugo, we pledge to follow you as the leader of the Firebringer. To be true to the name Flame Champion and to end this war, let us unite our forces against our enemy. Aw, yeah, baby. Aw, yeah. Well said. Our next step will be to step up headquarters. Step up? Set up headquarters for the Firebringer. The Brass Castle may serve to protect Zexan, but it's too far from the Grasslands. I doubt that the Great Hollow will work. It's not well suited for humans, you see. How about Duckland Village? Although, half of the village is on boats. I don't think Lily's down for that one. Hmm. If only there was some castle that doesn't really have anything going on there and, you know, was not really any grassland... Or, or Zexan, you know. I mean, maybe that if that existed. Oh, wait, look, Tom is chiming in. Well, how about our castle? Durr. It may be a little dilapidated, but it's big enough, and we're located between the grasslands and Zexan. Durr. A Durr. <laughs> Thomas is like, um... Tell us more. We're listening. Oh, uh, of course, yes. <laughs> he got scared, but he didn't realize that everybody was listening. Yeah, bro. They actually were listening to you, homie. Tell them more. It seems like the right choice. Let's make it so. I hope you don't mind, Master Thomas. No, not at all, sir. The people at the castle will be glad to help. All right. 
So we have a castle. Mm-hmm. Big surprise, am I right? Shall we head to Orange Castle? Choose your entourage, Hugo. I think everybody will be glad to come with you as leaders for the fi of the Firebringer. Okay, cool. So let's make a party to have our triumphant walk into the uh, castle. So um, I'm going to go ahead and tell you a quick note here. This is the only time, well, at least for a while, that we're going to be able to put Chris and Ghetto into the party at the same time and Lucia. So I highly recommend you put all three of them in there right now. They can be part of your escort because, well, Chris and Ghetto are the other two heroes and Lucia is your mom. You can keep Fubar and Sergeant Joe. I don't see why not. They're your best friends anyways. As for support, eh, we could put Fatty or Lewis or Mommy or who, who are we going to put? It doesn't really matter. We're just heading over there. Um, hmm. Hmm, we have a lot of choices now. I didn't realize we had so many people. As you can see, we now have one united army, so we can choose any of the people we've recruited so far. I'm just going to pick Luce for the fuck of it. Why not? It's going to be the only time I ever put her in the party, so might as well do it now, right? We'll catch up with you later. Don't waste time getting there. Of course not. Why would I do that? Are you calling me a time waster? All right. So anyway... Off to the Orange Castle we go! I'm actually quite excited about this, man. We are finally getting to the ass end of this game, and I love it. We're at finally at the point where our army is united, and we can use any and all of the characters we have recruited. I love Sukadin for this reason. God damn it, this is not the door. This is not the door. We don't want to go in the door. We want to go to the castle. We want to go to the castle. Let's do it. I want to do... I'm, uh, I'm not ending this episode until we go to the castle, so we're doing that right here, right now. Damn it. Gersh darn it. Gersh darn it. Gosh diggity dang diggity dong darn it. Gonna go to the orange castle. Gonna go to the orange castle. You don't know how I roll. <sighs> man, I'm out of breath already, man. I need some of this. I need some of this drink while we walk. Seriously, though. Seriously? Seriously. I, 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 I'm so excited, but you, I, I don't, I hate to brag on this game at all, but can you see how, why some people don't consider this as good as the first two games? I mean, do you see how long it took us to get to the point where we can use our army to its fullest? By the way, I just went the long way, didn't I? Son of a bitch tits. By the way, yeah, and you're seeing pretty much everywhere on the map we have been in the game is now opening up for us. So that's pretty cool, right? And I don't think there's going to be anything anywhere new to go at the moment. It's just opening up everywhere we've already been. Yeah, I'm pretty sure all this stuff is places we've already been. So that's cool. Um, I am on the wrong side of Brass Castle. See, this? remember the path that used to go up here that was really convenient? Yeah, that doesn't exist anymore. That sucks ass, I know. Anyway, I'm going to... I'll just meet you at the home... It's called Homeland now. Okay, that's cool. I'll meet you at the homeland. Wait, what is this? Tablet of Stars. I'll have to show you guys what that is in a bit. Should be obvious to Sukin and Vets, though. Put 
boom, but a 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 boom, 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 Okay, we're here at the homeland. Let's do this. Let's arrive at our new domain. Well, we're just kind of just in there all of a sudden. Ah, this is better than I thought. Of course, Orange has a long history too. It was originally built in... Uh, we don't want a history lesson right now, bro. And there's ship in the back. What is it? Oh, uh, this is, um... um it's a good location and we have more than enough room. Aw, oh, yeah. Let me give you your rooms and make the arrangements. Oh, are you in charge of this place all of a sudden? Please feel free. By the way, Ike should know where things are around the castle. He's likable once you get to know him. He is kind of weird, though. Huh? What are you trying to say? I suggest we settle in and get things under control here. We may be a united force now, but it would be smart to face the Harmonian army right away. Exactly. We should be as organized as well as united. Absolutely, by the way. Can you do something about these beds? I'll wake up with a sore back at this rate. Did you already sleep in one? How do you know? Uh, okay. Well then. Okay. Esteemed Hugo, you must be tired. I will show you to your room. My room? Yes, this way, please. The room is ready. Uh, thanks. Okay. What, um, do I get a special room? Is it because I'm the flame champion? Wait, what? I thought this was Thomas's room. You mean I have to share a room with Thomas? Lame. Please use this room for the time being. It's the best one in the castle. Oh, thanks. Take a look around if you like. A lot has changed over the years. Thanks. No problem. Well then, please excuse me. Okay then. Please excuse You are excused, good sir. And here we go! Um, I believe our party has already had been dispersed. Oh, I didn't even realize there was an opening in there. Was there an opening here before? We could just go from the bedroom to the fucking meeting room? I don't think that was like that before. If it was, I'm, uh, I'm, not, I'm, I'm not sure. This hole's still here, though. Can't forget about that awesome hole. What are you doing outside my room, Nash? Staring at me as shit. Look at the Joker just standing around and shit. So yeah, now that we have our army, man, everybody just kind of standing around and shit. Also... The suggestion box. The best part of every Sukaden game ever. Actually, there isn't a suggestion box in the first game, is there? Anyways, let's read some suggestions, guys. Greetings. You seem to always be busy. Yeah, thanks, Topo, for this observance. Do you know, to improve Earth magic, the best way to train is to be covered with sand up to your neck. Mm, I did not know that, but now I know. Did you know? About runes, it's not proper to bear runes blindly. You can show your true ability when you bear a rune that suits you. Ooh. I like the way you tell me that, Gene. 
Hey, Stingy, the special prize is at Renato Sexy of Books and Statues. Stingy, can't they be more generous like we are? I don't know. Why can't they be? Huh? Uh huh? I don't know. Anything else new? I guess that's it, huh? Anything else? I already read it. Okay. Also, another new thing in the feature is this thing on the wall here. Ever since we picked up Arthur, he'll tell you ran he'll he'll basically write news stories about things going on at the castle. We could have came and checked some of these out earlier, but I never did. Um, but anyway, Firebringers at the castle, the Zexan Knights of the Six Clans, the Grassland of the United Kingdom Invasion, Firebringers gathered the castle, have chosen as the stronghold, castle residents are excited, Brass Castle and Great Hall are considered, but not a good advantage to this castle, which lies directly in the middle. This came great news, and merchants are excited, and blah, blah, blah. Arthur, beautiful piece of writing, but duh. Okay, so now we are pretty much at the point where we can do whatever the fuck we want, literally. There's a few more story things, obviously, duh, but our main thing right now is going to be finishing up the rest of the recruiting. Yes, we're going to finish up all of the recruiting that we have to do in the next episode of Let's Play Sukaden 3. Are you, re are you hyped? By the way, I know I got, uh, I got distracted by the fact that I was leaving the Brass Castle by the wrong way. I was saying something about how uh, Sukaden 3's disappointment compared to Sukaden 1 and 2. A uh, big pro problem I have with this game compared to those two is how long it takes to get into this whole do whatever you want, here's your whole army, choose who you want thing. But I have to admit, Sukaden 3 does a beautiful job using the three different party, you know, three different hero thing to tell the story. So I can't hate on that part of it. The story is beautifully told in that regard. I just, the aspects of, that I like about Sukaden in general are not the same because of that. But I mean, while the, you know, general rules are there, you don't get to that same feeling because of how long it takes to get to this point hours wise like no matter what it would have took people as close to how long it took me to get to this point other than the extra grinding i did but anyway i'm gonna shut up now and in the next episode of let's play Sukuna 3 we're gonna recruit the rest of the stars of destiny that we can recruit at this moment in time so i will see you guys in the next one peace